card package for the day. Ooh. It's called the Caucus Race. And it is kind of a, it's green. It's like kind of a uh, light, very light green uh, with some brownish speckles and orangish speckles. I am really loving that these have the names that they're inspired by on them. I know I said that yesterday, but it's super awesome. I've never had that in an advent calendar, and I really like knowing what the dyer was thinking when they dyed it. Yay. I didn't eat my Godiva advent calendar on camera yesterday, and that was a bummer because it was super delicious, and I didn't even know that I really liked Godiva chocolate, but it was so good. So today there's like this milk chocolate thing. It's super good. So, it's a milk chocolate with milk chocolate ganache inside. And it's really good. Apparently, I love Godiva chocolate. I have brewed my espresso and uh, I use the AeroPress, which is what I use to make espresso. And it's really good. I'm really happy with this coffee and the calendar. Uh, I already drink coffee every day, so I just get to have like a fancy coffee. It's very exciting. I did mess up and I'm so used to putting the AeroPress up to four uh, because I usually make espresso for Chad and myself. Uh, so I forgot that it's less coffee than I would need to make a full four shots. So I put more water in. So it's kind of like an Americano because uh, I brewed it with a little bit too much, well, not a little bit, but twice as much, too, uh, twice too much water. So uh, it's kind of like an Americano, but it's still really good. And I think the name of it was Bourbon Espresso. So I don't, I don't know if that's just what they named it or if it has anything to do with the flavor. I certainly don't know. I just think it tastes good. I just got a package. The package was from Rifle Paper Company and my mom sent it to me because she's very nice. And it had a bunch of fun stuff in it. I got a Rifle Paper Co. Scrunchie, which is cute and has a little bow on the side. Put my hair in it. Hooray. I'll take the tag off. And a new watch band for my Apple Watch, which I'm really excited about because mine is gross. <laughs> it's, uh, I have the woven band from Apple and it's just like the white part of the band like gets all gray and yucky. But this is like plasticky, so, um, but it's still cute because it has floral print, so hopefully it will be less gross. And I also got my 2021 calendar, which is very cool. Um, so I am pumped to have a brand new calendar. And it, this is the Wild Garden calendar, and it has all different wildflowers on it, which is fun. Um, I have had a Rifle Paper Company calendar for the past five or six years. Um, I do a lot of date-based scheduling things in advance for my job, so it's nice to just have something on the wall that I can look up at and see like what day of the week different numbered dates are. Um, so that's why I like to have these calendars that don't have uh, like boxes to write things in because I keep track of all of my dates and appointments on my digital calendar but it's nice to just be able to glance up and see the dates and the days of the week for my job so that's fun the other little weird fun thing is this 
super cute like cardboard folder thing is what the packing slip came in for this order. So I guess I'm gonna like save this and I'll put a card in it or something because it's like a really cute Rifle Paper Company print that just has the packing slip in it. Just changed out my watch band and I am so happy with this Rifle Paper Company watch band. It is a really soft, nice silicone and it feels way better than my old uh, Apple uh, watch band. And it has a lot more size adjustability than my Apple watch band. It's way cuter and it's going to get less scudsy over time. So I'm probably gonna keep this old guy for a couple days and then toss it because yikes, it's all grody. And this one is so shiny and new. in there. These birds, they're outside. They're not inside. It's very exciting. They're going crazy. Okay. Okay. Escape maneuvers. So this is their poop. Gotta fight for dominance. I was gonna say, Winifred versus Meriwether. Who will reign supreme? I'm surprised I haven't started. There we go. Yeah, get some roosting going on. Yeah, I'm surprised they're not like up to the top yet. They love jumping up so much. They're hungry. I think they're hungry and they're like, what is this place? They're outside, they're not inside. I cleaned the bathroom for like two hours. It should be very clean. We should be able to shower in there. Mm -hmm. It's very exciting. And now we're going to eat this massive pile of food that Chad ordered to celebrate the chickens being <laughs> gone. It's ironically from a chicken place and he didn't order chicken. Everything but the chicken. <laughs> Hello, we've showered in our own bathroom. <laughs> It was an amazing experience. <laughs> uh, I cleaned it very thoroughly. I'd like to reaffirm how much I cleaned the bathroom because a lot of people have been really concerned about that. <laughs> uh, but it was very clean, and now we're clean people. We have matching plaid jammies on, like some sort of Christmas people, and we're going to chill out and bask in our poultry-free home right now. <laughs> Anything to add? Nope, just basking. <laughs>